My dear friend, I have written this letter to inform you of my latest research regarding ancient history. The oldest written fragment we have at the monastery is 20,000 years old. It is a receipt for a shipment of iron ore to the kingdom of Ure. Of this kingdom, nothing more remains than this banal receipt on a brittle piece of gray clay. This is to say what we know of the past is very sparse and fragmented. But there is a common thread to the ancient myths I've been researching. Through a violent cataclysm of fire, the world is reborn again and again. My sources differ on the exact time, but according to my research, the latest cataclysm occurred between 40,000 and 60,000 years ago. In the first 2,000 years, the sun disappeared. 10,000 years of strife and rivalry between primitive kingdoms followed before the world was suddenly plunged into a winter that lasted 5,000 years. After all this misery, the age of the endless summer came next. During this peaceful and idyllic era, the world and its inhabitants blossomed for 10,000 years. For some unknown reason, a few sources claim that the elves arrived at the end of that era. Then 4,000 years of a war against demons which invaded our realm. A great demon hunter named Uza, in some sources, Telek in others, killed the demon monarch and brought peace to the world again. The demon slayer was buried somewhere in the region now known as the Valahari Domain. Six thousand years ago, a great plague spread across the continent. The elves are blamed and forced into exile. Following the plague, more written history appears, and what I know is what you know. Only the Sylvan Dominion claimed to have an unbroken lineage that stretches back into the eons, and a written history of more than 200,000 years. What it contains? Very likely the cliché squabbles between their major and minor houses. Nevertheless, their history is hidden behind layers of deception and lies. But there is one troubling aspect of my research which I must share with you. The power of magic comes to this world in waves. The wavelength is 6,400 years. According to my calculations, our world will suddenly peak in its magical power in 200 years. What will happen, I don't know. Some ancient books claim everything will have magical abilities from an infant baby to a petite flower. Others say that the early gods will return to the world and walk among us. Monk Alexander Vladic of the Trinic Monastery in Caracas, 